Is this the first time I've talked out loud today? Yes. If you wonder how I spend my day, here's some clips of the things I do. If you don't care anyway, then well, this isn't about you. Hi! Yes, I'm vlogging, and yes, this is a bathroom. Um, I don't know how you found this video, but thank you for watching it. Um, an introduction to me. My name is Kennedy. I'm originally from Idaho. I love all things internet and I don't eat meat. Um, an introduction to my situation. I'm currently um, interning for the summer in Portland. I'm living with my brother and I have decided to document it via this camera. Um, everything that follows is stuff from this summer. I hope it's entertaining. <laughs> I don't know. I just wanted to show you this funny thing at this house that we're at currently. Um, so if I come over here, I'm going to turn this around. So this is some doors right out front. And if you look right down here, oh, yep, right there. This is my car. Um, it's a Subaru. I love it. It's my baby. But over here, you're like, wait, no, that's your car. Yeah, so the neighbors drive the exact same car as me, which is awesome. Um, I've only accidentally tried to get in her car once. Oh, look, some bikers. Hi, friends. Um, but no, it's just funny. So I have to be careful and make sure I'm getting in the right car down here uh, if I'm not paying attention. But um, yeah, great. Yeah, I'll see you again later. <laughs> then it just, oh, that one just <laughs> running over. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's just going to be a little shaky. But if, when it's sped up, I bet you won't even notice. But this isn't a time lapse. Oh, this is just video. But I can still speed it up in iMovie or something. That's why I need the thing. The thing in the bottom. Oh, there's a car. So I'm just laughing at myself. When I had the idea to start these vlogs and I wanted to make videos, I was like, oh, this summer will be the perfect chance because I will be in Portland and I can take the camera like downtown and I can show people what I'm doing. I'm working for a magazine, like everything will be so glamorous and fun. And then I realized that I never leave the house if I don't have to. It is 10.30. I have just woken up and showered. And today is Monday, so Caleb is working all day and I am here. This has been less of an, an adventure vlog throughout the city of Portland as I expected and much more of a watch me pack and uh, follow strangers through the window, but I'm gonna keep doing it, so. Also, at some point today, I have to handle this mess. Yes. What? There's like white goo growing in this sink. <sighs> but I have gloves. I have gloves. So we're, we're gonna get through this together, guys. We can do it. That's exactly how long it takes to get ready. Don't let anyone tell you differently. Fish tank? Anybody need a fish tank? Anybody need a fish tank? Take the fish tank. This man needs a fish tank. Take the fish tank, sir. It's free. It's free. Take it. Take the fish tank. Hey, buddy. Update. He's back on the bike. Still thinking about it? Think about it? No, don't let... Okay. Okay. Well, fish tank still available. Still available, still pending on the fish tank. 
We're taking a packing break. Feel your head resting heavy on your single bed. I wanna hear all about it. Get it all off your chest. Oh, feel the tears and you're not alone. When I hold you, I won't let go. I've been cheated by you since I think you know when. So I made up my mind it must come to an end. people were here. My mother was a genius. My father commended respect. They died, they left no instructions. It's just a legacy to protect. Death doesn't discriminate between the sinners and the saints. It takes and it takes and it takes. And we keep living anyway. We rise and we fall and we break and we make our mistakes. And if there's a reason I'm still alive when everyone who loves me has died, I'm willing to wait for it. I just pick my nose. Yeah. Am I cool yet? No? Oh, okay. You guys, so I came downstairs to find some breakfast but we packed our toaster, so I have my bread here, but the toaster is gone, so I went and did some sleuthing in the fridge, and I was so excited. <laughs> I thought this is so gross. I found, I can't believe it's not butter spray in the fridge, unexpired, and um, this is like nostalgia times two. So first of all, my grandpa used to always at dinner make bread and butter. Like it wasn't toast, it was just like the side dish, of choice was always just bread with butter on it. We would have it with every meal growing up. My grandpa used to always make that. Second part nostalgia, this freaking stuff, spray butter. Um, my neighbors, I used to eat dinner at the neighbor's house all the time and they always used spray butter. I have no clue why, but we would always have steak and Caesar salad and they always had the spray butter to spray on everything and we would, so I just, Wanted you to live this moment with me. <laughs> okay, here we go. That's the butt of the bread, so I'll try this one. Gotta fold it up for the most accurate portrayal. Hmm. That's some bread and butter, y'all. That's a breakfast if I ever heard of one. Hello. I am in the car. I just got done with work, just got home. Um, I felt the need to vlog in the car in my work clothes to prove that I do have a job. I do leave the house. I do do things. Um, also, let it be known, I left for work earlier than Caleb today, which means absolutely nothing because he's worked the last three days and I haven't. But still, I wanted it to be known. <laughs> I do things. Um, but yeah, today was just a really good day at work. Um, I was excited on the way home on my commute. I had my first moment of like, I was driving across this bridge and I just had the thought of like, yeah, I live here. Like, this is the thing I'm doing now. And that's weird and crazy. And it just made me want to, it made me think about all the other weird, crazy things that I've done in the past and made me want to reach out to all those people. I was just reflecting on that and like working in Montana or working at the Senate and like people from those events that are some of my best friends and how here these people that I'm meeting that I'm working with at work um, I've only been here a couple weeks so they're new to me um, and so I'm just getting to know them and learning about them but to know that like I have best friends from from other places such as my other jobs that now like I'm excited to see who of these people is someone who will be in my life forever because I'm sure there will be because you meet people with everything you do uh, I don't know, that's maybe doesn't make any sense and it's really sappy. <laughs> Let's go move houses. Ah! Oh, yes, I'm back in this house. <laughs> um, we moved most of our stuff over to the new house last night, but not all of it. So I've got a little bit more moving to do and mostly cleaning. So Caleb has, today's their opening day at the baseball field. So he's there at like 9 a.m. to 11 p.m. So he's gonna be gone all day. So I have been tasked with cleaning Meaning, all of this has to be cleaned. It'll be fine. We can do it. Look, I got, I got a broom. I'm ready to go. 
Um, but I started the day, I went over to a little cafe. I had the most amazing like breakfast sandwich and coffee, so I'm ready to go. And then I stopped next door to that cafe. There's a little bakery and I got myself a cupcake and a cookie. So we're gonna clean this house so that I can earn those rewards. Excuse me, I think you are confused. Can you guys see this? It's a phone booth. It's like a uh, phone booth from England, what? <laughs> I just got out of yoga, so I am a sweaty mess, but I just thought I would close out this week one vlog. Um, we did it. We made it through our first week in Portland, and whew, I'm so tired. I'm so out of breath. Oh my gosh, yes, that class kicked my butt. Um, yeah, more to come. Thanks for watching, if you did, and oh, more. More Caleb and Kennedy stories and adventures on their way. See you guys. Bye. If you wonder how I spend my day, here's some clips of the things I do. If you don't care anymore.